Because here at the Reddit tournament, we're classy. We're just classy guys here. I ain't going in the final round. When is final round? Yeah, that's. Uh, all right, let's see. Let's see if um, if Stickman, Stickman's learned something in between now and half an hour ago. Looks like it might be a maybe. Still doing that jab in here though. Why is that it still works? Cause he's got Nuffus in the corner. Rise the psycho up with the air Tatsu. Tatsu, but ends up just eating. Massive damage trying to punish Nuckfist's uh, escape. And the stun, and that, that's gonna be round. with the 200 IQ plays. I mean, like, I say it's 200 IQ, but but Sickman blocked it, so it's, it's more like 50 IQ, but you know what I mean. Ooh. Nuckfist with the Tatsu right over the, uh, the V-Trigger. Needs a combo for it, though. I love the idea, though. I love the idea of that. Kuma wins. The Nuckfist takes game one. Round one. Fight. Nuckfist finding a quick jump in. Now that he's got in the corner, punishes the V-reversal out of Sickman, but Sickman using that heavy punch to get himself out of the corner, but then uses the heavy punch to get himself right back into the corner, so it's all the same to Alec guy. He just took a little bit of damage, but who cares? He continues to work on that corner pressure, getting the throw into some meaty setup, and Stickman loses on another round. Foot to the face. And I've seen Stickman do that a lot. He's not comboing into a crush counter combo. He's going for those throws, which people should start recognizing. Like you should only fall for that once, right? Because you can't, you can't really be hurt by a tech and throw there, right? Or maybe mashing invincible reversal, mashing a DP after that. That might be a good idea. And Mystic Man's able to find uh, some space for an EX, EX Psycho Upper. Whew. Yeah, that was not a punish. Tatsu, Tatsu is minus on block, but it's not EX Psycho Upper minus on block. It's not that minus. Well, which allows Nuckfist to take game two. And Stickman looking like he might fall to the old, uh, might be being put out of his turn by the same person. Makes sense since it's a loser's finals, but you know, happens. Nuckfist is continuing to put on really great quarter pressure. Using those plus frames into non-combo, which gets double counter hit. And then, <laughs> and then Stickman thinking that he's already dead, but Nuckfist with no punish. And Stickman just stands there and then decides to, you know, just get hit. But there's one of the great anti airs that we've been seeing most of the night. Hopefully he's able to uh, start doing that a little bit more often. As 
Snuckfish doing his frame kills into meaty throw setups. Ooh. Sick man doing pretty good this round. Ooh. Into that, uh. Into that charge heavy punch. No any air on that jump that jumping down goes for that uh V trigger setup, maybe for just like tip, some chip, but then tries the XO over psych over as an air, but the empty jump out of Nuffis lands in time. And I was gonna say Stickman's on the ropes, but he just lands a neutral jump uh, heavy kick to close out the rounds. As uh, Nuffis has decided that, you know, maybe he just wants to start up a fireball again. I like the attempt out of the Annie Air, but Nuffis, on top of it, paints it out, gets the crush counter, drops his combo for the win, and gets Psycho upright. Nick Stickman tries to juggle the V trigger, but uh, doesn't quite have the timing right. Although that timing is super weird. Enough fist is able to close it out with a, a good air to air. Good air to air. Akuma wins. Taking it 3-0. Getting his second shot up against Alakai.